went ahead and went on the chase. Coming out of it, Hard Up is gonna get the kill there with a shotgun blast as Fleischer hits his rocket just near his feet, causing a little bit of splash damage. Question now, can Hard Up go ahead and do deny him the rail? Just deny him the rail and you can defeat him. Rail armor picked up by Fleischer, nine to four. Hard up, still gonna fight through there. Tries to drop down, hits the jump pad. Other yellow pick up by a great rocket bounce, but it's not going to be enough. Hard up's gotta be on the chase. And let's see if he can get the job done. Toss. Here we go, rail to rail, and it's again Fleischer's rail that shines through as he uh, lands onto uh, Hard up, who's now down to 59 points of health. Remember, about 30 seconds, 20 seconds ago, he had the mega oh. and was looking good, but now he's been dropped by Fleischer's shotgun. It's 10 to 4, and Fleischer looking good. Three minutes and 16 seconds left in the clock. Six frags on this one. Hard up having a hard time coming back. Fleischer with a great little peak rail right there, and we'll see Hard up answer back, putting Fleischer down just a little bit. Can he actually clean this one up? Lands another rail and a third rail, and Hard up will take his fifth frag. Now the question is, is can he convert here off of the spawn? He's gonna, he's just gonna help up here a little bit. No, he cannot. As Fleischer peeks over, takes that aerial advantage, lands the rail, and makes it. 11 to 5. 11 to 5, a nice open game we've had here. And uh, with three minutes left to go, still all to play for is Fleischer, not quite home and dry yet, as he will uh, go on the prowl. Catches a whisker of that rail that's just gone by as Hard Up goes chasing. Nice wow. rail landed by Fleischer oh. as he follows up with an excellent falling rail down onto Hard Up. Then we'll look to finish off with a conversion frag or at worst, send Hard Up running. And it's 12-5. Two minutes, 18 seconds left on the clock. The two minute warning about to sound. Fleischer on the receiving end of a little bit of shotgun buckshot there, but it's not gonna be enough to take him out. He recovers with a few health bubbles and now will make himself on the run. Another great, this guy's firing rails from the top, from the bottom. And I think you did right uh, down in our notes here that he is a very, uh, both of these guys are, are very rail heavy. They certainly are, but one of them is uh, rail is unstoppable right now. And that is, of course, Fleischer, who uh, gets himself another frag, and he can do no wrong with that rail, and that doesn't bode well for CA2, which is the next map. Yeah, I was actually thinking about that. You know, T4 is such a prominent rail map, but you've really got to be on the aim. You've really got to be on your game in order to win and, and claim victory here on a T4 map. But CA2, very rail, rail heavy, a lot of opportunities to hit some very, very good rail shots. And it, it will be an interesting um, second map. 115 left to go. Fleischer is up by 17 to five, so he is gonna take this uh, uh, first map. And well, his first map, his first land, his first grand final, excellent stuff from Fleischer. He is gonna be looking at this and saying, you know what, I should uh, come back more often. And, and it should be noted, Toss, Fleischer actually competed in one of the CTF teams who did fairly well here. Uh, they uh, they did make it fairly far in the tournament uh, amongst 19 teams here in the CTF uh, competition. And uh, you know, one thing to consider is that he's got a lot of experience, at least in CTF. That doesn't automatically make you a good dueler. You know, I played TDM way back in the day. I always sucked at duel. I never could play well. But it's just some people are are better at certain game types, and uh, you know, he's showing here at least. He can compete on an amateur level here in a dual scenario. No, you're certainly right. Fleischer has certainly got what it takes with that rail. He is, uh, he is an absolute beast with it. And with what, 10 seconds left to go on this, it's uh, all about making that scoreboard look a little pretty. And uh, he is gonna take this one by 21. Will he get that 20 second? No, 21 to six, the final score. Very, very good opening map from Fleischer. And we will be moving on to CA2. CA2, of course, a clan arena two map. And uh, I've actually started to uh, learn to love CA2. Yeah. A little so bit. two days ago, it was a case of uh, you thinking, hmm, CA2, is it right for, uh, for one versus one? And the answer is, after a, a, a really hard stress test over the past few days, yes. I, I would say I would say certainly so. I saw some.